just going to do a quick video for Sandra Gaspi Marine. We're on the Horse River this morning. Pretty nice little place called Milson's Passage. Trying to get there by, by boat. Anyhow, I just wanted to show how easy it is to set up Pro Fisher E electric net hauler. It's so easy. I'll do it one handed while I'm holding the phone to video. Here we go. That's in. Turn it around about where you want it. It's just in the little little mounting bracket there. A couple of tightens up on that. Done. Then you plug that into there, which comes from your battery. Done. Plugged in. And then it's just a matter of pulling the switch out. Way it goes. You can have different speeds, you can slow it right down, stop it there, you can just, just get a little bit of speed on it, or you can have it going flat out. Which it's got a pretty good good power ratio to lift the nets. Since I've been using it, my back's never felt so good. I wish I had one years ago, but I've only had, I've had, this is my second one, the first one's still going. I've had, had them for four or five years now, I think, Sandra. Yeah, that's the Pro Fisher E electric net hauler. If you're thinking about getting one, you're getting a little older, it's easy to pull it in. Net goes over through the rails there. It comes up. Doesn't damage crabs, you can winch crabs over it. Doesn't damage corks, doesn't damage the net. Like I said, you can slow it right down to a crawl. Just in case you want to slow it down a bit. And then emergency stop button. Right there. That's it. Adios amigos.